So if you want to grow your social media account, <laughs> identify as a woman. Yeah, female that, privilege. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> If you don't follow Zuby on social media and you don't fully understand, hey, Whitlock's got a rapper on or whatever, but Zuby is far more than just a rapper. Uh, you're a public intellectual. Mm. And you've been, uh, I think you've been kicked off of, or suspended for Twitter <laughs> for, uh, you know, saying the transgender crowd's not a big fan of yours. Is that, I said... I got temporarily suspended for saying, okay, dude, in reply to somebody. That's what I said. The tweet just said, okay, dude. Oh, you, is that you misgendered somebody? Is that what they're they, they were never specific. Someone was boasting about the fact that they sleep with more women than me, and I just said, okay, dude. And then a week later, um, I got an email from Twitter saying that I'd been, my account had been locked for hateful conduct. And I was like, wait, what, what's going on here? Initially, I thought it was like a, like a phishing, like a spam message or something. And then I tried to go on Twitter, and yeah, I'm, I'm locked out of my account. And the offending tweet is literally, okay, dude. And so I, I thought it was some type of mistake. I appealed to Twitter, and then it got a human review, and they confirmed the following day that I'd violated their hateful conduct policy. So of the 100,000 plus tweets I've put out there, the one that went past the line was me saying, okay, dude. And so did you say, okay, dude, before or after uh, you announced you identified as a female <laughs> and broke some weightlifting records? Yeah. Uh, and that, that stuff didn't get you in trouble? Uh, uh, no, that, that, no, that didn't get, get me in any trouble at all. That was February 2019. So that was the flashpoint. So I've been on Twitter since 2009, and it took me 10 years. At the beginning of 2019, I had about 17, 18,000 followers. And that viral deadlift tweet blew up. That's how millions of people across the world discovered me from that, from the Joe Rogan to Tucker Carlson to Piers Morgan, Ben Shapiro, like people all over the map in all these different arenas. That video was seen by millions and millions of people. So that was the flashpoint where that was like a tipping point where I came onto a lot of people's radars and then through that, People discovered my music and my podcast and my writing and my general thoughts and commentary. And ever since then, it's just been growing and growing and growing. So if you want to grow your social media account, identify <laughs> as a woman. Yeah, female that, privilege. Yeah, <laughs> that, that will do it for you. Wow. And so you said in 2019, you had 17, 18,000 followers. Yeah. And now how many do you have? On Twitter, 820,000. Yeah. Across the board, I think about 1.3 million.